The city of Camas will have to pay nearly $5,000 in fines for not staffing enough firefighters during a daring rescue. The state cracked down on the city after two firefighters were forced to save a man from a burning building, but then they didn't have another person there to spot them. Our Jennifer Dowling is live in Camas tonight with more on this. Jim? Well, that happened back in February, that fire. And while there's supposed to be three people in a situation like that to make it safe for firefighters, sometimes that just doesn't happen. In fact, the union told me here at Fire Station 42, sometimes there's only two people to send out at a time. Now, at the Prune Hill Fire, as we've been talking about back in February, a man was trapped in a burning home yelling for help. And when the two firefighters showed up, they had to go in and get him. They could not wait for another firefighter paramedic crew to show up. The city tried to appeal the $4,800 fine from the Washington Department of Labor and Industries, but state regulators upheld it, citing a violation of workplace safety laws. The East Clark Professional Firefighters Union says ideally there should be three people on an engine at all times. To do that, the city would have to add at least 15 crew members for engines alone. Meanwhile, yellow yard signs have gone up around town supporting the firefighters. Well, I think we're all in a little fear at any given moment. Um, if there are two incidents at the same time, then we're all a little worried about what happens in those situations. Camas City Administrator Peter Capel says the city council met Monday and is proposing adding one new fire marshal position and four firefighter paramedics for the 2019 budget year with the potential for adding another four every two years. However, the union says that's not enough to address staffing levels for response times and to add enough uh, people to the engines. We'll have more on that coming up at five. Back to you. Yeah, firefighters are in a tough spot. You sit there and wait for more backup or you go in and rescue somebody. Thank you. If you have a news tip, we'd love to hear from you. Email it to reportedatcoin.com or click the Report It tab on our mobile app.